This is how Chris made the bee feeder. We use an old mason jar, this one I had salsa in. Bees like their sugar water to be a lot stronger than hummingbirds. So you fill it up halfway with sugar, add hot water with a solid cover, give it a good shake. Then you will use this cover for the feeder. So Chris just drilled a bunch of little holes in it. At some point we're gonna to have to replace that cover because it is getting a little bit rusty. All right, there's already a couple of bees in here. I don't want to add the sugar water on top of them. Come on, guys. Shoo. Move over. So you want to always put down little pieces of gravel, rocks like this. So this guy, come on. I'm just going to be really careful when you put it in. Then you just tip it upside down. And it'll only come out just enough where the holes are. Oh, there's that bee, he's still safe. Always attracts a few sugar ants. And I always keep like one, sometimes two rocks in there. I started off by using the hummingbird flower at the beginning just to attract them to the feeder. All right, see, they're already starting to come. This thing will get filled in a matter of no time. And I'm finally getting used to them. I used to be nervous when I did this last year, but they don't bother you at all. They're really grateful. It's kind of cool today. It's only in the, like maybe mid fifties right at the moment. So they're really grateful for any help you can give them. So there you go. Simple feeder that helps the bees.